Hello everybody, how are you guys doing today? Welcome back, welcome back to some more breakwaters. Let me fix the light a little bit. A little light, there we go. Tiny bit better, not much, but it will do. How's everybody doing? Thank you guys for being here. Thanks for the six likes over on YouTube already. That's awesome. I see you currently uh, one person watching over on Twitch and seven on YouTube. Thank you guys all for being here. Hello, Sans. Hello, William. Thanks for being here. And we are back with some more. Last time we worked a bunch on the boats. We made a whole bunch of them. As you can see, we have our boat, uh, our boat dock there. We have two ships right there. And we have another ship right there. Pretty good, pretty good. I really like what we did with the place. I really like the water that we made here. But what I want to do today is I want to expand upon the base bit. Because we still have all of our chests. Or well, the free chests. And all of the materials like all the cooking stations, hammock, like workbenches. We all have that on that hill there. And I would like to put a couple of things inside the house that we made. Because it makes sense. Otherwise, we just built this place without any purpose. So, yeah, we're going to put something in here. We are going to probably make a little farm. I think this would be the perfect location. Put like a, a strip of farmland. It's not going to be a huge farm. Not going to be a huge farm, but it will be nice, I think, to put a, a little strip of farmland, like right here. Like two or three plots, if that's possible. I don't I don't remember how big they are, um, but we'll see how it works. I think that will be really cool. Hey, Brock. <laughs> hello, hello. And Corn. hello. Good to see you're back. Um... Where was I? Yeah. So farmland, workbenches and stuff inside. And I also want to make new workbenches because we haven't made all of them yet. If we go take a look here, the only ones that we made so far is the builder's bench, refinery, and we haven't made the crystal bench, we haven't made the forge, and the cooking bench, we haven't made that either. So those are a couple of things that we still can make. Uh, it should allow us to make those. Oh no, we can't make the crystal bench yet. That's uh, an obtainium. We we f we do have <laughs> an obtainium, um, but that was uh, yeah. We we we're not gonna use that because we're not supposed to use that. We already did use a little bit last time because I really wanted to see something, but I'm not gonna use anything of it. Because uh, um, it's, pr it's not finished, so there's no reason to use it. Right. We need to forge. We can make the cooking bench. I think we have to... Um, require it for some recipes. It is locked, so I don't know how to unlock it. Maybe it will unlock itself after making the forge? I assume it does. Glad to see you made a lot of cool things in the game. Yeah, yeah, we, we were... Well, we haven't made that much. We only made a house and a couple of things. We haven't made anything too crazy yet. There are a couple of things that I really would like to do, though. <clears throat> what I really would like to do... And I don't know... If that's easily to achieve. But what I would like to do... Is I would like to make... I don't know what it's called in English, but I would like to make a sort of a canal which you, you you drive the boat into, right? You sail the boat into it, and you close the gates, you close the door, you let the water rise using the water pipes and the sensors to, to bring it higher up, and then transport the boat from over here all the way over here that would be really cool if we can do that i don't know if there's a good place to do that though i think the best place to do that would be right there because there's already a little i don't, I don't know there's already a little area there 
leading from the ocean over here. Then it wouldn't have to be that far away either. A canal with locks. Yeah, with like what water locks. I mean, I already have this water pipe here, so I don't know how that will work. But that would be really cool if we could just fill it up with water, make it rise a tiny bit. Doesn't have to be uh, like uh, 10 blocks high. Then bring it over here, make it go down again. And then we have a, a little boat over there. So that would be cool. But that's probably not something that I'm going to do in this world, in this save file. I think that would be something I would like to do in like an early access version of the game. So like in a couple of weeks maybe. Hopefully things will have... Uh, uh, will be more finished then. And maybe some crafting recipes or maybe the building will be easier or... Whatever, I, I, I don't know. Uh, but I think it would be best to wait with that, with such a project. It would be fun, though. Hello, Drac, by the way. Good to see you. How much FPS are you getting? I get about 30. I have no idea. I, I don't know how you even would look that up. I think it's uh, pretty good. I don't know if there's a key for that to be able to look that up. I have no idea. But I feel like I'm getting uh, 60 at least most of the time anyway sometimes there's a little stutter that's only like for half a second or less but usually it's uh, it's really really good um right so what are we gonna start off with i think the first thing i'm gonna want to do is maybe make more crates because we currently only have three crates and it's not awesome not awesome we have a lot of random stuff everywhere and I don't like it I don't like it at all so what do we need for crates again crates we need that branches seagrass Get the seagrass. Uh, iron in here. Put that away. There we go. Ballista. And we need... Oh, three branches as well. Beautiful. Already make two crates out of that then. Good. Put those inside of the house already. That would be awesome. Team has a setting for that? Oh, I don't know. I, I mean, the only game I've ever looked up how much FPS I got was Minecraft. Because that's just easy to F3 key and you got it. I don't know if Steam has a, a hotkey for that by default. I don't know if there's a hotkey for it. I probably want to put it like against the wall there. And not too close right next to each other. Otherwise I'm gonna grab the wrong crate every single time. I think that will be fine. Something like that. Then another two over there maybe. Or maybe I should just do it along the wall. Along this wall. Hmm. Or maybe all the crates on the end. On the back. Not sure. Not 100% sure on that yet. Well, let's collect some more resources, shall we? Look at all the trees that are walking towards me the whole time. See, it's moving again. The trees keep moving. Keep coming towards me. Uh, there's so many so many logs everywhere I don't want any of the logs either they're pretty useless right now the tree branches are useful for a lot of recipes moving trees oh yeah 
Yeah, the ones with the crystals, with the blue crystals, they, for some reason, they move. We haven't been told yet what the reason is, but the developer has told us that it is part of the story or some sort of lore of the game or whatever. So, I don't know yet, but um, yeah, I guess it, it's normal, <laughs> I guess. It's supposed to happen. We don't know yet why, though. It's pretty fun. I like it. It's very different. I mean, in Valheim, you have trees that can kill you if you cut them down easily. They can easily kill you if you cut them down. And in this game, they don't kill you. Not yet, anyway. <laughs> Not yet. Uh, but they do move around and creep you. So, yeah. It's one thing or the other, I guess. Either trees that uh, that want to kill you, or trees that are following you everywhere you go. I think I'm gonna put them on the back here. I think that would be better. I'm gonna spread them out a little bit. Yeah, let's get my hammer and get rid of those. I think I'd much rather have them over on this side, all of them. All of the chests over on that side. And then we'll do like a hammock over here. We'll do like a little picnic table on here maybe. We'll do some some, some pots with plants over on this side maybe. Where am I going to put all the workbenches? Oh boy. I'm not even going to have enough space, do I? Well, maybe the cooking station I will do that outside. I guess I could do the cooking station like right here. Or right here somewhere next to the water. And then a fire pit. Well, we have to farm over here probably. Oh, I don't know yet. Yeah, I, I might, might change some things up or add things to this little bit here. Maybe I'll add like another wooden floor over here. And I'll do the campfire here or right next to it here. Maybe. Oh, that's through the wall. <laughs> Did I put that here as well? No, here it's fine. We're gonna have to make sure we put that down correctly. Is there a way for me to destroy this? This doesn't take damage from me. But I do know that we can destroy it. Well, a, the uh, AI can destroy it with cannons. So maybe we can destroy it as well with, mar with our ballistas. Maybe. How you doing, Bluebell? Good to see ya. And Logan, good to see you as well. Um, you hope that they will optimize, optimize update in early access. That would be great. Yeah, I, I hope that for you as well. I mean, for me, honestly, the game is... Is 90% good enough to... Uh, well, good, good enough is like... It's not really a good term, but like it, it doesn't have any performance issues for me 90% of the time, is what I'm trying to say. Like 10% of the time, there's a little bit of stutter, there's a little bit of like a, a lag spike for like half a second. But other than that, it's it's really good for me. But I also have a pretty good PC, so I guess there's that. At least for single player games, I have a good PC. For some reason, multiplayer games, <laughs> my PC doesn't really like those for some reason. I don't know why. That's still an issue that I'm trying to fix. We don't have any meat, do we? No, we don't have any food right now. Three branches. There we go. Those away. Go nice. We can make more crates. Very, very good. 
We are slowly dying because of hunger. That's why you see the white little like damage popping up every now and then. Place this one right there. Perfect. Another one. Uh, right there. Go. Another one. There. Yeah, that's pretty good, right? Like three planks. Three planks. All three. Okay, good, good. Almost all of them are like the same distance. That's good. I like that. We need more tree branches. Any more moving trees that want to be dead? I think you are a moving tree that wants to be dead. That angers me. They're walking towards me. It's quite nice, actually, that they walk around because it actually makes it easier for you to uh, collect stuff <laughs> because they keep coming towards you you don't have to go very far to collect your tree branches and stuff i mean at least the ones with the blue crystals not all of them there are plenty of trees that don't walk towards you like these these don't have the crystals so they won't walk towards me Ooh, two AIs. Normal trees and a blue one. Let's cut down that blue one over there. Might as well. Really enjoying these breakwaters. Break Wait, what? Sorry, can't read that word. Recovering from my last chemotherapy round and enjoying the chill vibes of the streaming the game you got the great work whoa i didn't i didn't know that you uh that you had that wait did you did you ever tell me i think i think somebody oh not now i now I feel bad maybe you did and i don't really remember it i'm sorry if if you did uh but i hope you're doing well i hope the uh, last therapy session um, went well. And I hope you don't have to go back to that either. Make some more crates. Oh yeah, let's get the hammer. Uh, iron hammer, demolish hammer. Get back there. Demolish hammer down there. Oh yeah, I hope they want. I hope they change the icon for the iron hammer and the demolish hammer, because that confuses me the whole time. That's so confusing. All right, that works. Beautiful. Get those materials back. Oh, you can actually use the hammer to see through stuff that you build. <laughs> you see? You can see the water down there. Oh, that that's another thing I would like in this game. It's like a glass floors. That would be awesome. Having glass floors. Cuz then you can actually cuz if if you if you guys don't know, some of you might not be aware. What we did is you made a water pump pumping the water in here and what we also did is using one of the blue crystals on the island that generates water to bring more water over here as well there you go there's the crystal so we're bringing this water slowly down here this was supposed to be a bridge which i didn't finish yet <laughs> But yeah, the water will go in here, 
and will eventually spill out there to the uh, to the ocean again. I thought that was really cool. It doesn't work perfectly. I wanted to make it a little different, but I couldn't, sadly. Um, but it works. You can see the water slowly flowing and like evaporating. But slowly entering the ocean, actually. So that's really cool. Um, but yeah, it would be cool if there was, uh, if there were glass floors and stuff hopefully in the future maybe uh you you didn't all good well i hope you're doing fine man thank you very much for watching i i really enjoy having you around and everybody else as well hello kadia the king of the king of the island returns hope all is well in the tropics <laughs> yeah all is well i'm doing fantastic thank you it did thanks a bunch unfortunately it's un ongoing unfortunately it's ongoing the great conduct makes recovery for it much better ongoing what do you mean by ongoing I, i'm not sure what you mean by that mm -hmm. let's see let's put the rest of the crates in here um turn it like this no yes like this okay and three planks again Whoop. and another one down there beautiful not on the perfect straight line but good enough Another way of saying it's a constant thing. He means continue his treatments. Oh, okay. Well, hopefully it's... Uh, hopefully it will be better. At least. Someday. It's definitely not a... Not a great thing. And I really hope that... Someday... Uh, someday there will be a good uh, solution for... For all the diseases like that. For all diseases that need treatment like that. Because it's... It's just horrible uh, having to go through that stuff. Both for the person and for... You know, the loved ones and such. Alrighty. What's next? We can probably demolish all of this. Get rid of that. Um here we go. Another crate. Change the demolish hammer. Now let's demolish this one. Demolish this. Pick up. Oh, we didn't really need that, but whatever. Uh, we can demolish the fire pit. The hammock. Will we have enough inventory slots? I don't know. Now let's make all of this first. Hey Peter. Yeah, I'm doing well. Things all the time. So there's always new great treatments coming out. And better days to come. Yes, indeed. Luckily, we... Well, yeah. Luckily, we are in a... In a place... Like, in, in a century... That... Has a lot of... Uh, technological advancements... And medical advancements. And that... Yeah. So... Yeah, luckily, we are in a place like that.
in a uh, what? I, I I say it wrong, but you get the you get the point. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. All right, builder's bench there. It's a good spot for it, I think. And then we needed to make the uh, refinery as well. There we go. Let's make a refinery. Maybe let's make the refinery out here somewhere. You don't want that stuff in your house. Especially in a wooden one. Yeah, so let's just put the refinery outside. Oh, it lights up as well. That's nice. That's good. Yeah, we are almost dying. Let's make the hammock. Or actually, we have the hammock. Never mind. Uh, let's get the hammock quickly. Let's go in there. Heal up. No, I... Never mind. I did demolish it. My memory is so bad. Crazy. My memory is so bad. I wish I wish they had a had something for memory because I need it. I need it. Something to improve my memory. That would be nice. And let's just place it in the middle, I guess. There we go. Still gonna take damage. I don't know, Peter. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not sure. I mean, single player games seem to be fine, but... It seems like as soon as I'm playing a multiplayer game online with people, my PC just for some reason doesn't like that. I don't know. Because this game seems fine, I haven't had any crashes with it. Oh, the audio just went up accidentally. I touched the wrong buttons. But, um,. Yeah, like like multiplayer games seem uh, seem to be the problem for some reason, but I don't know why. I don't know why it would be. Internet connection is fine, as far as I'm aware, and I don't know why that would close the game and end the stream automatically, because then it should just try to reconnect the stream instead of closing it and the game should just buffer or bring you to the main menu instead of crashing so yeah I don't know but I uh, I did get in contact with somebody who knows a lot about PCs and stuff so hopefully that person will uh, will um, respond and uh, help me out with that and help me find the problem. That would be really nice if that was possible. Mm, we need food. We need food ASAP. Do we have more mushrooms? No, we do not. Do we have materials to make? No, we don't have the fire coral yet. We have the crystal, I believe, in here. Yeah, we have two crystal. We need fire coral. That's a sea anemone. 
Hey, Daniel. The Anemone. More sea anemone. Wow, there's a lot of seaweed, actually. Or a kelp, I mean. There's a lot of it. Ah, daytime. Right. I need to find some fire coral. Oh, it's still glowing mushroom, really? It's practically daytime. Ah, there it is. Beautiful. That's what I was looking for. Ooh. Careful not to get too close to the... Yeah, that's what I mean. I do need the food. Alright, let's run. Run! Get away! Yeah, let's swim to safety. How are we doing, Booster? How the game going? Have the NPCs come back for you? No, not yet. I went to them, as you can see. <laughs> they are stuck over there. But all is good. <laughs> nah, they didn't come for me. I came for them. Just gathering some materials nearby. You know how it is. You know how it is. Put that in there. And then uh, this. And then we can make ourselves one of those. Beautiful. Let's actually start using the storage that we made. Let's see. I really want to have signs. Signs are going to make this a lot easier. But I think what I will do is I will do... Hmm. I think I will do seagrass and stuff over here. Gonna do mushrooms there. Mushroom, coral. Can we farm the coral? I don't think so. No, then we won't do the coral. This will be farmable things. This will be just for farming. So for anything that we can get seeds. And this will be for everything from the ocean that we cannot get seed, seeds from, like the seagrass and the kelp and the fire coral and stuff. I guess we will do like all the wood over there. New stone over there. Um, I don't know, like walls maybe in this one. It's really gonna confuse me where everything is. Maybe I can do something to indicate, indicate it, make it easier. Maybe put like a 
spotted plant right next to it. Or something. You love the water texture in the game? Yeah, the water is fantastic. The water is really cool. Come on, jump out. You can do it. There we go. Actually, I guess this chest would be good for weaponry and tools. Because we can easily use this stone to remember where it is. And then we'll do the redstone right next to it. Uh, flare, we'll keep that. Okay. I guess for now we can put water and such in there as well. Water bottles and food. We can put that in the farming chest. Cloud shadows. Yeah, maybe they'll do that in the future. I mean, the weather, the weather and such is not fully implemented yet. Because it's, it's never... It's never bad weather, basically. I mean, in, in the distance, you see sometimes like thunder and stuff. Or you even can see it close by. But it doesn't actually rain. Like, there's no actual bad weather. Here, you can see thunder, but nothing really happens. It's not really uh, implemented yet. So I imagine that there will be some cloud shadows maybe in the future. Maybe that will be an option. Uh, okay, wait. Let's cook those mushrooms first. We won't be starving to death anymore. Throwing mushrooms to regular mushrooms. There we go. And I will need some wood. There we go. Get some food. We finally won't starve to death. How about that? There we go, and one more. Beautiful. Alright, let's see if we can place those a little closer to home. Fire texture is cool, yeah. That looks pretty good. The bigger, it, the bigger the flame gets, the less good it looks, in my opinion. It looks a little stranger if it's, uh, it's larger, but it's a little strange, but it's still, it's still impressive. I definitely wouldn't be able to make that, so. <laughs> hey, foodie food, thank you very much for becoming a member again. That's awesome. I told you yesterday you didn't have to worry about not being a member, but thank you very much for being back anyway. That's awesome. Thank you very much for the support, man. I appreciate it. And good to see you have your purple badge now. That's awesome. That is amazing. That is amazing. Let's put a fire pit right here. I think that's a good spot for it. Right there. It's a really good spot for it, actually. I like it. I only wish that the uh, the grass would change as well. Like, maybe it will become dirt. Like, the, the grass in the middle, you know? 
the middle where the where the logs are the wood i always that, that would like be removed that'd be cool or like like ash maybe like black ash gray i guess or maybe put this one outside Ooh, how about that nice Right now, we can only go up and down with our camera when sitting. But I did make the suggestion that they change that to also allow you to look around. And I believe uh, Soaring, the developer, said that he would uh, take a look at it. He thought it was a good idea, I think. So hopefully in the future we'll be able to like look around when we sit. I guess what we could do for now... I guess what we could do temporarily is just build it differently. Just build it right there. There we go. That will work. Now you can look out into the ocean. That's beautiful. Nice. And the water still. Let's do the water still. Could do it here, I guess. Wouldn't make much sense though on the on the planks. Maybe I could put it here. Yeah, let's put it there. Doesn't make much sense because there's like dirt te textures. But I guess it's fine. <laughs> it's alright. For now it's fine. We can always change it later. Right. But it already looks a whole lot better from here. Look at that. That's already so much better with the chests. Fire. Solar, uh, still, picnic table. So much nice. Awesome. All the fallen trees all around me. Beautiful. Absolutely magnificent. Now I'm gonna be all evil and stir up trouble once more. <laughs> Stir up trouble once more. Uh oh. That's not good. That's not good. What else can we do? Let's make a forge. And hopefully, that will unlock the cooking bench. Because I want to get that. I want better foods. This we cannot get yet. Steel metal, fire pit, redstone. Steel metal, fire pit, redstone. We have fire pits out there. Makes sense because if the... If it rains, the water runs down the roof, down into the water thing, I guess. But then I would have to build it like a right, right underneath the roof instead of next to it. Oh wait, these are roasting pits, not fire pits. Mind. That's not all we need.
Grandpa looks so nice. I like it. Righty then. Let's make that fire pit. And we need four redstone for that. Do we have that in here? Exactly. Beautiful. And we needed that for making the forge. We need five redstone for and steel metal. What do we need for steel metal? I think for steel metal we needed charcoal and iron. And charcoal is made from logs. Oh wait, it's from palm logs, isn't it? Not pine. I think it's from palm logs instead of the pine one. Didn't I have more? Uh, there we go, iron. Get some more redstone then. That's pretty much the only thing missing right now. Is the green giant still there on the island? Over on this island, you mean? Yeah. You'd be somewhere around here. Oh, he's right there. The big, the big lock there. The water. That's him right there. There you go. There he is. Oh, there he is. Throwing sideways. I can't hit that. Fine. Be more of the redstone. Hard to see sometimes. Oh, there we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Exactly what we needed. You know how to defeat the giants? I believe it is possible maybe with the ballista from the ships. With the ballista shots. I haven't ever tried it. But like all melee damage and all range damage with a bow only does one damage. So I think you might be it, but I yeah I think you might be able to do it with the uh, with the shots because they do like 50 damage or something, or at least towards players and stuff they do a lot of damage. So hopefully against those as well. How did you even get in here? It's closed off. You're not even supposed to be able to get in here. I'm not sure if you can put them on the ground. I know you can put them in ships because that's where you built them in the in the boat deck. I don't think you can put them on the ground. I haven't ever tried it either, so maybe. I would have to test that out. You can? Too many trees around. That's something I will have to test out. As I said, I've never tried it, so... Hmm, palm locks. Let 
bet I would much rather do it by boat. That would be cool. Just sailing there. Sailing there and then... Uh, and then shooting him. That would be cool. My god, so much water. The waves are crazy. Full. Um, get rid of that. Don't need that. There we go. Nice. And let's go back. Hey, crap. And now we should be able to make the charcoal. Go. And then we can make... Steel metal. There we go. Beautiful enough. And now... Isn't here. No, put that all in there. Make ourselves the porch. Ah, nice. That unlocked the cooking station. Beautiful. Now let's put the forge out here. Forge right next to it. Right there. Because these can connect the water and improve efficiency here we can i believe we can put things that we want to make in a list and it will make them over time what's that called like put it in a queue or something pretty useful um Alright, what's next? The cooking bench, I suppose. Rid of that. Oh, okay. Eat seagrass, pine logs, empty bottles. We have all of that. Uh, we should have all of that somewhere, anyway. Yeah, there we go. Bottles. And then the seagrass. And the logs. And then we can make the cooking. Awesome. Alright, let's put that. Um, we'll put that outside like this.
Group it inside somewhere. Maybe inside right here would be nice. The middle of the window. Oh. <laughs> the fish is inside of the wall. Uh, okay, let's fix that. That's not what we want. There we go. And we can even put the water pipes through the wall here to improve the efficiency on this one as well. And there we go. There's all the recipes that we have unlocked. These three. So we can get raw meat and mushroom coral for 15 hunger. That's much better. We can use a chicken egg for 20. That's good. We can use salmon. 25. That is really good. We can use oyster room. Raw muscle. Raw muscle with sea anemone for hydration. <clears throat> and we can use red sea anemone with mushroom. But it doesn't give food then, the mushroom coral? Okay. I guess it can be used for both then. For mushroom coral here, we'll give food we'll give, with, uh, rap, with rap meat, raw meat. Here of sea anemone, it will give hydration. Hunger, hydration, and health. And a raw... Grow, uh, glowing mushroom will give 25 health. Uh, quite raw. It looks like it's cooked over here. It looks like it's the cooked version of the mushroom coral. Maybe that picture just have to just has to change still. Maybe it's an older icon. Raw food, cook, make it. Oh, okay. We have to cook it to make it edible. Let's see. So all, oh, wait, oh yeah, all of this we have to cook first. So first we have to make this, the raw ingredients. We have to prepare it. And then we have to cook those somewhere. Okay. That's it, yeah. Right, that's pretty cool though. So I think the easiest thing to get is this. Red meat, mushroom. Salmon are a little bit difficult to get. You can only get those right now by taking the water from underneath them. Make them drop on the ground or by just picking them up from the beaches sometimes. The eggs are actually easy, I suppose. But there's not too many of them. Do we have some eggs somewhere? Not yet. Alright, but let's get some mushrooms then. Or some, uh, yeah, some of the mushroom things. Uh, do we have... Do we have any of the crystal torches somewhere? I think we have it all the way over there. Ooh, but we can get these maybe. Yes, beautiful. We can immediately get the seeds as well.
Beautiful. Might as well get some sea anemone while we're at it. Hopefully the sea anemone will be farmable then as well. That'll be nice. You'll farm those in the future. Right, we can't make that yet. We first have to make these. We make one of those. Which will unlock that one. Uh, oyster. and I think we have both of those. This one. Um, got it in there for now. Temporarily. Cook that. That will restore 15. Water. Looks nice. Just a simple picture of the cooked meat and a mushroom icon. I like it. And then just eat it. 15. Awesome. Ah, we should have eaten that while we're. Oh, whatever. Some water. Go. And now we can make the other one. That one. Yes. And we can make that one. And we can make that one. Awesome. Whole bunch of water. Ah, uh, look at the fire. Beautiful. Two more after this. There we go. Yeah, those probably need some more work. Let's see. <clears throat> 20 hydration. 25. And one more. Go. And then these are extra. Awesome. That works well. And we just need more food. So for all of these, for all the hunger, we need meat. And currently the meat, the only way to get that is by crabs, rats... For the boars. Hmm. Hopefully the boars are gonna be a farmable animal. It'll be nice. At least it will always give you basic food then. Now I'm not getting any rats, of course. I believe at night time they spawn more frequent frequently. The night time is actually a good area, a good time of the day to uh, go look for them. Um, I would kill the boars, but we actually need the pig poop. I would kill the pigs. I still think they're boars, but I would kill them, but I think we need that uh, that poop from them. There's a little bit of frame rate right there. For some reason, all of a sudden.
I guess maybe because we're close to these. Maybe that's causing some issues. When I'm walking around. Running around. My inventory is full. Hey Stormy Cat, how are you doing? Oh. Is the water actually going down here? Doesn't look like it's going down there. So we might be losing a little bit of water there, actually. So we might want to increase that wall a little bit. Yeah, this seems fine. We got one more piece of meat. That's, not, that's basically nothing. Okay. Let's go hunt for some more. <clears throat> Hope you're doing alright, Stormy Cat. And hello, Lily. Good to see you as well. Yeah, I'm doing good. I'm doing fantastic. Thanks for asking. Characters dying a little bit. Just a little bit. Um. Won't say anything. Need the sticks, get those berries, the berries, and then pick up the sticks again. Alright, we have a couple of shrooms. Let's put this way in there. Get farming stuff in there. Make some more food. Go. Just calming your head down after work. Who's are so chill? Well, enjoy, I would say. So calming. Foods. Finally, we're gonna be surviving a little bit more. Is 
instead of dying the whole time. Only stacks up to five? Ooh, that's not very far. That's not a lot. Um, well, it's all right. What to do now? Okay, first let's get more health back. Go sleep a little bit. Wait till we'll have a little bit more health. And in the meantime, I'm gonna drink some water. Don't forget to uh, drink something yourself as well if you're watching. It's important to hydrate every now and then. Halfway there. As you can see on the bottom left of the screen, you will see those uh, those three hearts there. Or the like the the black hearts fully filled in black. Those are hearts that you can fill in with with actual health. They will become red if you sleep enough, rest enough. Those those three hearts are your are your health bars actually. You have three health bars. And the ones that are not filled in, I guess you will get those by leveling up. You will get more health. Currently we have 525 health. What's the building like compared to Valheim? The building is very different. The building is very, very different. Uh, if I... Let's see. Like, for example... If I build a stone wall, if I make stone walls... You just make a regular stone wall piece. And then when you're placing it down, you can right-click it. And it will just change into a half one... Or one with a hole like that. Uh, you can just rotate it, of course. There's there's less rotation options. In Valheim, you can rotate it like... Like like 10 degrees, 20 degrees, 30 degrees, etc, etc, etc. Or whatever. Um, well, no, that's, that's not true. But like... 45 to 90 or whatever. But here it's uh, here it's only like a full like four like eh, what's it called? You, you have horizontal, you have diagonally, and you have vertical, and like that's it. You have you have less options like that, but it's still pretty cool. I can only imagine that they will add more building functionalities and building options in the future but it's pretty easy that you can just make like one building material and then just right click the one that you want pretty easy i do hope they allow a little bit more clipping because I wanted to do this one right there. But it didn't... Oh, now it works. Oh, of course. Of course, now it works. Now that I'm complaining about it, it, it works, of course. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, can't complain now. Never mind. This didn't work before, but now it works. Beautiful. Nice, that will make it look a little bit better now. Look at the water flow. The water slightly flowing out. That's cool.
I wish you would see it a little bit better over here. You can see that the sand is darker from the hydration in it. From it's wet from its wetness, I guess. But I wish I were able to see it actually flow down a little bit more. You turn the camera like that, you can actually see it a little. You see it in the corner there. Like right next to the webcam, like right there. Next to the stone. You can see it float a little bit. Can you dig a trench in the sand? Uh, sadly, not yet, no. I, f I believe they are planning on doing terraforming, though. I believe they are going to do some sort of terraforming in the game. So that's going to be really cool. Because that will allow us to do a whole bunch of things. Like, once terraforming is in the game, it will be so much fun with the water physics to build, like, a canal or something. That would be awesome. Because right now I'm just doing it, you know, with the tools that I have. By using the water pipes and... Building the house a little higher. So that I can have water running underneath it. But when terraforming is there, that would be awesome. Then I can actually dig out an area here. That would be so cool. That would be really cool. What I could do, do though. I could do... this will that make it more and not really oh that actually stops the water it doesn't oh no it, it still goes out okay. not as much as it used to Yeah, it sucked the water somewhat. And now it's back to normal again. Even more water in here as well. Maybe we need more water pumps or more water pipes. Bring more water here in here more quickly. Get rid of that item there. Yeah. Hey, you guys are all cute in the chat. Sending each other kisses. You can also hug each other. Exclamation mark hug. And then the person you want to hug. So you could do exclamation mark hug. Uh, Stormy Cat, for example. Here we go. And then uh, Stormy Cat will receive a hug. Shortly. If the bot works. Please work, bot. Please do it. Please do it. Come on. There we go. Took a while. Yeah, put the sticks in there. That in there. I guess we'll get, we can do metals and such in here. All right, let's work on the farming. Make a dirt field. We need clumps of dirt, redstone, and big poop. 
Yes, that's exactly why I needed the pick poop. I forgot about that. Huh. Drag hugging himself. Lol. Soup. Oh, thank you for the soup. And thank you for the ice cream. Even though the command didn't really work. It, it is uh, exclamation mark and then ice cream without without a space bar between it. Without any space bar, except for between ice cream and the name. Uh, what was I going to do? I was going to do something, but I don't remember now. Um, oh yeah, more pig poop. What are, what are those other treat booster? Sort of stroop waffle? Waffle room? What? <laughs> stroop waffle is what you mean, I guess? The mighty stroop waffle. That's chickens. That's mushroom. I need to find more boars. The game is very laggy in this part. For some reason. <clears throat> If I stand still, it's all good. Exactly. I give you guys ice cream. You guys can give me soup. That's right. Let's go down here. Run away. Run away. Ah, there we go. More pick poop. Beautiful. I wonder if there's a way to lure them. I don't think so. Not yet, anyway. <clears throat> That's like a fair trade. <laughs> fair trade. Ice cream for soup. Yeah, I guess. Have you gone to the island the pillars connect to? No, I haven't gone there yet. That's probably something I would, uh, I should be doing at some point. But I think that might be the last one. I don't I don't think there's anything there. Because I, I think what will happen. Because I believe the trader, the, the, the quest giver on this island said that there were multiple ruins. So this one. Um, so this one goes towards here or something. And then I think this one might go towards there. And there might be another one that goes that way and maybe that way. And then the Titan will be like... I don't know. Like caged in or something. I have no idea. I'm not sure. It's just speculation. Because that part of the game hasn't been added yet.
But it's supposed to be like a cage. Because it's a titan cage ruins. And yeah, as, uh, as Sand said, it's a... Wait, what? Yes, uh, yes troop ruffles are kind of like a cookie with a waffle pattern. Yes, I guess. And caramel like in it. Uh, Sergio, hello. Sergio M. Incredible game, very nice indeed. How are you, Booster? Hello, chat. I'm doing good, thank you very much for asking. And yes, this is a beautiful game and a lot of fun. Now we have found 19 of them, that will be good for now. Do we need more... Redstone? I think we do. Let's go back here, actually. To get some more redstone. Oh, more pig poop. Nice. I've never been this happy with Big Boo. Never before. You guys are just doing all the commands, huh? That's that's fun. That's cool. I want better commands, though. Like, these are just the basic ones I came up with at, like, day one. So if you guys have any ideas for commands or sound effects that you guys can play in the stream or something, then just let me know. And I will see what I can do. And if that's something I would like myself. I don't want it to be too distracting either. But if you have any suggestions, then feel free to, uh, to message me about them. Now let's go back to base. I think we have enough. Yes, smearcast is like cheese that you can like s spread cheese. I think somebody once said that. It's 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 like um, it's sort of like peanut butter, but then without without the peanut, of course, without the peanut flavor. But it's just cheese. It's just cheese, but like in the form of peanut butter. Like, it's not fluid, but it's not a solid either. Like, yeah, spreadable cheese. I, I don't know how to... Uh... Cheese butter. Yeah, sort of like butter, I guess. You could say that as well. But then, cheese... It's something that we have in the Netherlands quite a lot of. We have quite a lot of it. At least our household has a lot of it. <laughs> I like it myself. Um. Oh yeah. I kind of forgot what we were making. Now we need more dirt, right? Yes, we need dirt. So what we have to do for that... Quite simple. Well, actually, it should be simple, but because of this bug... 
it's not gonna be too simple because it's gonna spawn in bags which is gonna make it difficult oh, a lot of cannonballs Okay, I'm pretty sure we're not supposed to get that many cannonballs from shoveling. What the heck? Uh, is this another bug? Oh no, are we not going to be able to get dirt? No. No game, please. I want dirt. Give me dirt. Oh no. Game, please. Game. Uh, go to the beach. I don't think that's gonna change anything, but let's go to the beach. I need dirt. Please give me dirt. No. Oh no. I think we got a bug. It only gives cannonballs. It doesn't give any of the other stuff. You're supposed to get dirt or bo or empty bottles that are dug in the sand or a coin every now and then. Like a lot of different things you can get from digging with a shovel. But now it's only giving me cannonballs. Okay, so we can't do any farming because we don't have dirt. Yeah, you guys are making me hungry, but that's fine. <laughs> that's okay. Uh, do we have any dirt in the chests? Maybe we have one or two, hopefully. No, not a single piece. Not a single piece, okay. Eat those berries. There we go. Get those seeds. Get if you want. You want good Dutch food. Make at home. Look up. Stumpot. Oh yeah, stumpot is good. Indeed. Did the command earlier for for uh, ice cream not work? Why does do, why doesn't that one work? Should be fine. Oh, I don't know. Anything with a. Kalbasa on top is fine with me. What is a kalbasa? No idea what that is. Let's see that back in there. Let's put the meat in there. Uh, the pig poop as well because we need that for farming. Um. Stone in there. Put a whole bunch of those. Oh, we have more of this. More bottles. Let's oh, polish for, for sausage. Okay, cool. Like a Polish version of sausages. Yelp. Put that in there. 
Uh, what are we going to do with the dead rats? Um... Yes, we can... Yeah, I don't know. Let's put them in here, I suppose. Sure. Right, what else can we do right now? Let's see. Could make a weapon. Wait, we haven't actually looked at... Forge. Look at this. Look at all the weapons that are gonna be in the game. I mean, the icons aren't there yet. But look at all the names for them. We got a maple bow, which is already... Oh no, it isn't in the game. What? I thought it was. Okay, that's strange. I thought the bows were in the game already. Um, okay. Maybe a different kind of bow. You got bows, giant turtle axe, blue metal axe, black metal axe, dragon glass, python stone axe, sea crystal sword, giant turtle sword, blue sword, black dragon glass, titan stone. And pretty much the same thing over here, but then for the hammer. A lot of different weapons. And tools. Oh yeah, we can make ballistas and cannons over here as well, looks like. Huh. But these are specifically for land. Okay. But these you can specifically put on land then. But the other ones, you are supposed to put those on a boat, but these, you are allowed to put them land anyway. Coconut bombs. Oh yeah, I forgot about those. Those are, uh, you need unobtainium for those. An arrow that explodes on the impact. We could make those. Takes a while to collect the resources. The list of shots. Let's get a ballista. Uh, I will need more palm for that. Yeah, that's possible. Just have to get another shipwreck somewhere. Should be plenty around. Uh, the ice cream command is only for Boozer to give you ice cream. It won't give ice cream to other people. No, the ice cream sh uh, sh command should work. You can know what you you should be able to uh, to use it as well. You do exclamation mark ice cream and then um oh no yeah yeah you you cannot do a name. You just do exclamation mark ice cream without a name, I believe. And then it and then I give you an ice cream. The, pe the person who uses it will get uh, get an ice cream. That's how it works, I believe. But I can set it up the other way around as well, like a different command for giving to anyone you want. Quite easy. Hey Jessica, good to see you. Uh, right, I was already forgetting what I was doing here. Oh, that's fun. Hello Anthony. You're new here? Welcome. I hope you all uh, enjoy the stream and the game as well. Have you watched Breakwater's gameplay before? 
Do you know what the game is? Are you in the Discord of Breakwaters? I'm not getting any bomb locks from this. Only two so far. I would like to get a little more. Oh, jeez. You have a little bit, you're in the Discord? Cool. Uh, you've been waiting for this game to come out on console. Oh, for console, it will take quite some time. Because first they're making the game for the PC version. And in console, they're gonna work on that after. Um, I don't I don't know when exactly they're gonna work on console. I don't know anything about that. But I do know first they're gonna work on the PC version. So sadly, you are gonna have to wait a little bit longer then. And enjoy the ice cream. <laughs> Army Cat, enjoy it as well. Might have to download it onto your laptop somehow. Yeah, I guess so. If you have a laptop that can uh, handle games like this. Otherwise it would be uh, a waste as well to buy it and not really be able to play it. With, uh, with maybe 10 FPS or something. That would take away a lot of the game, I think. So in my opinion, it would be better to then wait and just hope that it arrives shortly for you. Bought any titans yet? Well, the smaller ones we can definitely fight. Um, Lista. And we are working, actually right now, I am working on fighting a bigger one. I don't know if it's going to work. I don't know if I will actually do damage to it, because I believe... I believe they said that... He couldn't be, um, couldn't be defeated yet because he is a higher level. But I am gonna work on it. No, no problem. You can ask as many questions as you want. And thank you very much for uh, subscribing to the channel as well. That's awesome. Look at that. Two thousand one hundred thirty-one youtube subscribers that's awesome thank you very much for being number 31 there that's amazing now what was i looking for i already forgot my memory is the worst i swear oh yeah steel that's what it was steel metal But we are going to try. We are right now going to try to fight something. I don't know if it's going to work. But we're going to find out right now. Get rid of the... Uh, go. Watch the video that was a couple of months back and the Titan had constant regen. Was the bug or was the early access stuff? Yeah, it, it's still in closed beta, the game. So that's why I'm not sure if I can fight that one right there. But there are smaller ones, like the one over there. 
and even smaller than that because that's that's bigger than me the one over there there are smaller ones than that bluer ones blue smaller ones then you have that one then you have that guy over there and then somewhere is a huge blue titan roaming the world i don't see it anymore but it it should be in the game somewhere uh, but yeah this guy if you fight it with a with an axe or with a sword it only does one damage to him so i'm hoping i'm hoping that this will, this will do damage to him i'm not sure if it will we're gonna find out oh <laughs> I fell off. <laughs> Alright, that's... That's a bug I can report. If you use that... It will just slide off if you are on an incline. Okay, are we ready? We're gonna fight him. Hopefully, hopefully we do damage to him. That saved the game, actually. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> and let's go oh okay that does a lot of damage oh wow that did so much damage I was not expecting that did he drop anything I doubt it the stones over here no he didn't drop anything <laughs> and he's just floating like that well he must have a very strong arm he has his arm on the ground he's pushing himself up he is so strong look at that i can't do that i can't even i can't even um push do push-ups 10 times i'll be out of breath with with two push-ups already and he does it with one hand what a champion. What an absolute champion. Well done, sure. Well done. Oh, there's... Ooh, he did drop an item. Mega Golem Rock. It looks like a regular redstone. There's no icon for it yet. A Mega Golem Rock. Nice, he did drop something. That's awesome. All right, now we don't have to worry about that guy anymore. That's good. Can we move this? I don't think we can. Maybe with the demolition hammer we can destroy it again. Uh, no, it doesn't look like we can destroy it anymore. It was like kind of stuck there. Yes. We can't really aim further than this either. There we go. Look at the damage. That's awesome. The explosion looks a little funny. But it's pretty cool. I like it. And now this is also something else. Greystone. That's supposed to be, I think, like a higher tier stone. We can't do anything with it yet. But I believe that's supposed to be a higher tier stone in the future. You guys try it. Always see. Uh, try it anyways. See if we can fight. Yeah. Yeah, looks like we can fight it. Looks like we can actually defeat it and do damage to it. At least with the ballista shots. That's very easy though. It only took like what? Four shots or something? Uh, yeah, like I think like four shots. It's basically nothing. That's pretty easy. Did a lot of damage. Now let's go back.
Oh, that looks cool. That looks really cool. I need to finish this bridge. I need to finish the bridge there. Yeah, I mean, the game is in very early stages. It's still uh, closed beta. Early access will be arriving to the PC version of the game in about a month. Like either either this month in October or in early November, like the first two weeks of November or something. Then uh, early access will be released for the PC version. This is nice. Really cool. Look at that. Boats there. Let's do some sailing. Who wants to do some sailing? I do. I would like to do some sailing. Get rid of all the stuff that we don't need. Take the ballista shots. Hello, 74 artillery. Hey, Chase. Uh, is there many bug in the beta? Uh, not too many. Not too many. There are, of course, bugs. And every time that I play, every time that I live stream, I find at least, like, one or two, or maybe three. Sometimes, but... You know, it's it's still closed beta. So that's okay. That's totally fine. And even in early access, you can expect there to be bugs. It's all testing, of course. Uh, okay, we have two bottles. Didn't we have more bottles? Somewhere? I don't know. We have more water, though. How you doing, Chase? Good to see you. Thanks for being here again. Drink that water. Not a bottle in there. Let's wait a second. Go get some more health. I also notice that the longer we are playing, it starts to get more laggy. Like in a play session, I mean. Not necessarily the world, like... Not the amount of days, but the longer you are playing a session, the laggier it kind of seems to get over time. It's not too bad. Just a little bit. Fill up with water, please. Thank you. How long have you been playing? Uh, now almost two hours. Almost two hours today. We got some water. We got some food. Let's get some of the boat repair stuff. Lista. Um, was this the, the better ship? Medium boat. Um, which one was the better ship? Because they all look the same right now. I don't think there's... Medium boat. Don't remember. Well, I think they have the same health point of anyway. Alright, let's get this one. Because this one has the ballista. I guess I'll put this ballista in there then. We have nine shots with us. 
Just in case. Boat repair kits. Oh, let's do some sailing. Go around the island. Um, or maybe we should go around the island that way. Because <laughs> there's a lot of people waiting for me there. Ooh, salmon. Turn the sail. Oh, wind changes. There we go. Look at that crystal. So cool. Who's all in chat today? Right now, it seems like everybody is gone all of a sudden. There were a lot of people here before. <laughs> a lot of chatters. We had Stormy Cat and Sands, Lily. And a couple of others. Now everybody seems to be quiet all of a sudden. Everybody lurking, I guess. Wind is changing again. Ah, there's Stormy Cat. The pillars just stopped there. That's the last one over there. Looks like it anyway. Oh, changes again. Wow. Wind direction changes quite a bit. Not in my favor either. I could go against it. That's a little slow. I mean, it's the same, actually. Oh, we should have brought the... Um, should have brought the grapple thing. Then we could get some crystals from that. Or see if they added something new to it. I don't think so. Oh, actually, wow, there's a lot of... There's a lot of seagrass on these islands. Look at that. Wow, there's a lot of seagrass on these islands. That's good to know. Whole bunch. Okay, those pillars just stop in the middle of nowhere. They don't even seem to go that far. I thought they went much further into the ocean. Brushes, uh, teeth brushed. Close mint flavor at Stormy. <laughs> Lol. Half napping, listening to Booster with his super chill vibes. Awesome. Awesome. Ooh, is that a is that a Python, a small one, on the middle of this island? Check it out. Some berry bushes. They haven't really worked too much on these islands, I don't think. It's gonna be one of the small titans. Hopefully we can find it. Uh, or not. What are you? I guess this will be something in the future. Maybe this will be the large yellow uh, crystals. Because we have to find these large yellow crystals, which are not in the game yet. 
So maybe that's what this will be. Just a placeholder for the large yellow crystals. It's definitely large, so that checks out. Not much else on these islands, I think. Hopefully with the next update. Because I believe they will do like a biome kind of update next. When the early access hits, they will do like a biome and a couple of other things. Hopefully they will... Uh, add on to this as well if that's what they had in mind sail around a little bit more change the sail there we go oh um. Going against the wind. Still a little bit strange how this works. The developer told me as well, like... They, they wanted to make it more realistic with actual tacking and stuff. But that he was afraid that a lot of people uh, wouldn't enjoy that. Because that's probably something that will put people off. Because it will be too difficult for them. Or it will take too long to get somewhere, maybe. So that's why they uh, they changed it up. So that you can actually sail against the wind. But at a slower speed. So tacking will be better. Because it will be faster if you do it correctly. Getting ready to curl up in my duvet. Ah, <laughs> uh, giving hawks to everybody. Thanks everybody for being here, by the way. Haven't said that too often today, but uh, yeah, thank you guys all for being here. See a one P person watching over on Twitch, Drag. Thank you very much for being here, and everybody else on the YouTube side. I see twenty-five people watching there. That's awesome. And 34 likes so far. If you didn't know, I am multi-streaming to both YouTube and Twitch at the same time. So feel free to hit that follow button over on Twitch. And the subscribe button on YouTube if you want to see more. On YouTube I will also record videos for Breakwaters for example. And other games. Like tips and tricks kind of videos. And all the live streams will be available on the YouTube channel as well, of course. If you are missing out on the stream, then you can uh, watch it back later. They're beautiful. We made it around the island. Trader still around? Yeah, you can summon the trader. The trader is still a thing. There we go. Okay, you won. I'll subscribe. Good, good. Yeah, uh, I see it. There we go. Number 32. <laughs> the spark. 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 -ient. Thank you very much. For the follow. Just came over from YouTube. Nice. Awesome. Wait, who was 32 then on YouTube? Because this is YouTube. <laughs> was it you as well? Are, are, are you spark, Sparkians? Or alt, Altillery? Are you the same person? Or are you somebody else? Let's see. 
Move this over in here. You're the one that asked about the trader. Oh, okay. Cool. You are uh, Anthony then. But thank you very much for the follow. I appreciate it. And for the subscription as well. I don't know why the subscription is not popping up then. Yeah, maybe it will take some time. Put the ballista shots in there. And oh we got cooked meat. How do we get cooked meat? Oh well. Gonna put that in there. More tree sap. You prefer Twitch over YouTube? All right, that's cool. That's why I'm uh, streaming to both. So that people who prefer Twitch or prefer YouTube can just watch wherever they like. That's one of the best things about it. So everybody can just enjoy the content wherever they hear it. Let's eat some of that. There we go. Beautiful. That is awesome. Um, okay, is there anything else that I could do right now? I wanted to make a farm, but I cannot do that because we're not getting any dirt using the shovel. That's one of the bugs that we found today. That we can't actually dig up dirt anymore. We can only get cannonballs from it. Which I guess we could do that for a tiny bit. <clears throat> because we will have those cannonballs in the future then. That will be useful. Let's just dig some cannonballs for a minute. But yeah, you're supposed to get dirt and gold coin and tar and like empty glass bottles and a whole bunch of stuff from digging with the shovel but now it only gives me the cannon bull sadly so we can't actually do any of the farming because we don't have the dirt, the dirt. We got a bone. Okay, so it gives us a bone. Oh, there we go. We finally got dirt. What the? Here we're getting new stuff. Wait. The only one streaming in the category. That's crazy. Yeah, there's not a lot of people with, uh, with access to the game. Okay, now we're getting dirt all of a sudden. What the heck? Why why weren't we getting dirt before? Now we're getting dirt. <laughs> wow. We got like 13 cannonballs in a row. And before we got another like 10 or something. Okay, well... Looks like we are going to be able to make a farm finally. But we still have the, the bag bug. Which I believe they're going to fix in the next update is what I have been told. I believe I, I believe that he uh, that Soaring Pixel said that in the Discord. That it will be fixed. So for now we're going to have to interact. Oh! water bottle actually i thought it was gonna be an empty bottle even better with water in it so as everybody who uh, is watching right now and who's enjoying the game wishlisted it on steam if you uh, want to wishlist it on steam or enter the discord if you haven't i have a link in the description on youtube go in there to both the steam page 
and the Discord. But I also have a command in both YouTube and Twitch chat. Exclamation mark BW. And if you do exclamation mark BW, the, uh, the bot will send you a link to both the Discord and the Steam page. So how do you split the water? Um, how do you split the water? Oh, you can use... Uh, Hold on, let me, let me see. I don't know if I have anything on me right now to show you, actually. I don't think I have any of the materials I need. Well, there are two ways to do it right now. One way is this. That is a refined yellow crystal uh, bottle. So you throw the bottle with the refined yellow crystal. And then it will temporarily get rid of the water in that area. And there is a torch as well. The torch I have somewhere over here. We can go to walk towards it. I have two torches out there somewhere. I think I see it. I think it's out here yeah there it is so that right there is a crystal that is holding the water or pushing pushing the water away those crystals right there are the blue ones those are generating water this one is pushing the water away did I destroy it? I guess I have to. Why does it say minus 908? Let's make a screenshot of that. There we go. There we go. And the water comes rushing in. <laughs> so you can use those crystals to make these torch things. And these are also pushing the water. that's one way to do it so you can either use these torches or you can use those bottles and I throw the bottle and then temporarily it will uh, <clears throat> get rid of the water it'll push it back oh nice there's a couple of crystals here how do you get more crystals? Just by uh, by doing this. Just by smashing the big shiny ones on the beach. That's how you get the crystals right now. There might be uh, more ways to get more crystals in the future. But right now, this seems to be the only way to obtain the crystal. You can get crystals and you get shards. And... Ooh. Hold on. There you go, get that. Let's go back home. You have crystals and shards. And I don't remember which one which. But for... I think you need a crystal for the refined bottle. And I think you need shards for the... For the torches. But I'll take a look at that in a minute. Because I don't remember correctly which one is which. Oh yeah, now, now we can make the farm. Let's make a farm as well. Just a small one. Oh, actually, I could have shown you off that one. <laughs> I have a torch here as well. I forgot about that. I have this one that pushes the water back here. To, uh, to create the lake. 
actually have this one. This creates the lake for me. Jumps on booster and shakes. Shakes all the... What? I don't... Can't, I can't read that. Sprinkles onto him. What are you saying? Crazy. Crazy Stormy. They're looking for a gaming laptop now. Yeah. That's that's gonna be uh, too much money to uh, to buy for o for only one game. <laughs> I would not recommend doing that only for one game. All right, let's see. Yeah, so you need the yellow crystals for the refined for the refined yellow crystal bottles. And you need Okay, and you need the shards for the Tiki Torch. Now, I think it might be better to change that around. Hey, stay tuned. Good to see you. What is the purpose of the pipes? Bring water? Yeah. Yeah, we have a water pump. You can create a water pump and you can use those bamboo pipes i have a pump right there in the water and that brings the water all the way down here to fill it up and you can also have like sensors so you could actually make a water elevator using the sensors it will probably take a lot of time and effort to make it but it uh, should be possible. Okay, but right now I have three of those bottles. It's not a lot. So let's uh, let's show you how it works. That's the first bottle. Second bottle. There we go, and the third. This is how it's done. And as you can see, some of the water goes back into it. If there is too much water, the area will become smaller and smaller. Because, it, because the, the yellow crystals only have a certain strength to them. Like, for example, the crystals have, like, a strength of, like, 100, for example. But if there is too much water around, which is mo which is exerting more pressure, more strength, then the crystal can hold back, then it will actually become a smaller area, because the crystal just doesn't have enough power to push back all the water at once. Looks more powerful than the torches? Yeah. It's more powerful than the torches, but it's temporary. It stays for a very long time, but oh, see right now. Right now it's disappearing. It stays for a very long time, but it's only temporary. And the torches are actually gonna be there forever. The torches will never, like, stop pushing back the water. So that's the better that's the good thing about the torches the torches are less powerful but they are like infinite and the refined bottles are temporary but they are more powerful that's uh, that's pretty fun that's pretty cool now let's put back those cannons that there um Resap. Gold in there. The useless stuff. Where am I going to put shards? I guess I could put shards in there, maybe. Bones will put in there. Seagrass. Oh no, see, yeah, seagrass I wanted to put in here. 
Okay, then we have we have dirt. Um, we needed this, and we needed stones. There we go. Dirt fields. I think I can make. F oh, I can only make two. Okay. There we go. Cool. Get rid of that one. There's another wall there that we should probably get rid of because it's clipping inside of each other now. Just like right here. We got him. Let's try that again on the other one. I have to aim more for the edge, I guess. Maybe. Seem to work on the other one. Ah. Doesn't it work on this one? Come on. Come on, game. Yeah, whatever. It's fine. Yeah, it's alright. Hey, Craptor. Are you building all the things? I am building some things, yeah. For sure. Building some farm plots. Get some mushroom coral. Well, actually, those are useless. Above water. Do I have anything else? Um, the only thing... The only thing for above water would be the fire... No, that has to be under water as well, like... Ward of... Let's see if we can find some seeds. I think there's might be something up there. See if we can get it. Right there. Fire flower seed. Okay. Watch out, chat. This is gonna be the bomb. Yeah, we didn't get anything from that. Didn't get anything from that. I think it only gives you something when it's like underwater or close to water or something. Oh, there we go. Now we got it. There we go. That's a nice explosion. Maybe it just flew off somewhere. Flew off into the water. Hey, I can see something there. Oh, it's a berry. That's very good. Alright, cool. What's there, the smoke on the other side of the island? Oh, that smoke right there? That's from a bandits or pirates camp that was here before. 
That's this. For some reason, it keeps creating smoke, even though it's not turned on. I don't know why. It just always keeps creating more smoke. We got rid of the pirates a long time ago, but... Rats? Yeah, there's rats. Hey, the soul. Good to see you. I thank you for the, for the like, the soul. That's awesome. Thank you so much. Thank you guys all for the 37 likes. That's amazing. 18 people watching over on YouTube and free on Twitch. Thank you guys all for being here. That's awesome. Right, so now we have the fire flower seed. And now we can plant those over here. Um, oh, wait, actually. Ah, it will be fine. It will be fine. There we go. Nice, we got some farming going on. Won't be able to eat it. <laughs> but we got some very basic farming going on. Awesome. That's pretty cool. I think... That's where I am going to leave it for today, though. I did what I wanted to do for today. We moved everything inside of the house. We still have three crates there. We still can do some uh, inventory management, I guess. And move all the items into the house. But at least we made ourselves the chests. We put it in there. We put the hammock in there. The workbench, we made ourselves a new cooking station and a cooking bench. So we have better, uh, we have more and better access to food. We made ourselves the picnic table right there, the campfire, the roasting pit actually, the refinery, and we made ourselves the, uh, what's this called? The forge. We made two new things today. We also fought the Titan. Well, not the, not the biggest one, but. The, uh, the bigger green dude. We fought him with the ballista shot. If you want to see that and you haven't. Then uh, go back into the live stream I would say. Or the video after. And uh, yeah we did, we, did, we did quite well. I am happy with what we did so far. I don't know what I will be doing next time. There isn't a lot. Anymore that I can do. I guess what I could do is like building more things. I could gather resources, build things, kill rats. I definitely I'm going to have to finish like this, this bridge here. I want to finish that. Maybe I will do some more stuff with the water pipes and the sensors and just experiment with them. Maybe uh, we'll, we'll see. If you guys have any ideas on what to do on uh, breakwaters, then just let me know. Thank you guys so much for being here. You guys are awesome. Thank you guys for the follows today over on Twitch, for the subscriptions over on YouTube, for the likes, and for just being awesome in chat and talking to me and asking questions. That is amazing. I hope to see you guys next time again. Have a good day. Have a good night. Until next time.